So we're looking at how important law is for the development of financial markets in the rising powers in Russia, China, um, India and Brazil. And the, the, the big question here is, do these emerging markets require a Western-style legal system in order to develop fully, and in particular to see their financial markets develop? So we're looking at how law is changing the way the markets work in these countries, and also the way in which a rule of law um, is gradually becoming established there. Th these are some of the most important economies in the world, and they're not very well understood. So we often have cliched um, understandings of how Russia and China in particular operate. So a very important part of our work is to try to bring evidence to bear on these issues and to communicate this effectively to a policy audience in the UK and more generally to UK society. So I, I think that, um, in a way, the, the rise of these other economies um, is, a, is a challenge to, to Western democracies. Um, so we have to work out whether we're not just competing effectively at an economic level, but also whether our institutions are as effective as they could be to preserve democracy here and also to maintain economic growth against these new models, which aren't all democratic. Uh, India and Brazil are democracies. Uh, Russia and China have democratic elements, but are not democracies um, in, in the Western mode. So thinking about competition between different types of system is an important part of this process. But also in understanding those other systems, I think we begin to understand our own system better.